like here, like let, let's take uh, petroleum engineering for instance. Yeah. You know, like it has like it's broad. Yeah. So for we over here, once you start, you start like from bachelor's first year, you start specializing in one field. Mm -hmm. Because like we you can decide like maybe maybe if you want like the development of the oil and gas fields, you can go to that side. Or if you want uh, the transportation, mm -hmm. that's a pipeline uh, engineering, you can do that. Then if you come to a development, you have a uh, drilling of oil and gas wells, mm -hmm. and you have those some people to choose to do uh, like ex exploitation and uh, production. That's like uh, oil gas. Yeah. Some do production of oil oil. Then we have like the the gas condenser as well. Like, okay. So this one you start okay. with bachelors, but you start specializing from bachelors. But when it's like Ghana, we do like in general, like in general. Are you sure we don't have just this? They don't specialize. I have mates who are doing petroleum engineering in tech and in uh, UMAT. Mm -hmm. They just do it like in general. Petroleum so they, engineering. They, they, they study it's everything. Petroleum in engineering. They, they, okay. When you work, you get paid. Yeah. So what so, what so is it about so, the money? So it's not the about money. the money. No, not the, the money. money. Not the money. It's like, not like everyone is standing for the money. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you're also here for the money. Of course, <laughs> you go to school uh, to work on the money. Like, like he is studying. The, the, the language, you know, it's very easy to to write. Yeah. Very easy to read. If you know the alphabet, you can read. Yeah. And you can write. But memorizing, understanding, understanding what you are doing no. is yeah. not, right. that's that's yeah. the main yeah. thing. No. You know? but still, so they, maybe most people will go for lectures. Me like I asked you like which which word like, like you, you are not serious. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not serious. Like, <laughs> okay. Yo, welcome guys. My name is Immobilians and um, if you are new to this channel, I educate the world about culture, education, you know, like everything about Russia. So if you are new to this channel, kindly consider subscribing. Um, like this particular video, leave your comment or suggestion in the comment section and um, just recommend this channel to your friends, all right? So uh, in today's video, wait, 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 go to the playlist section and click on um, programs in Russia and the programs in Russia you can select any uh, program of your choice it could be medicine it could be um, IT it could be you know cyber security or anything of your interest and then you can watch and educate yourself as to the respective programs in Russia and what's their entailed and how you know the professors teach um, their students especially the foreign students so in today's episode I have my friends you know they are my brothers because we are from the same country and it's gonna be dope because you know we have the rapport ready so it's not like we are now going to introduce ourselves but for the sake of the audience i just want them to introduce themselves and mega i don't know maybe let's let's not just roll it let's just roll it because today is going to be fun you know i'll, yes. I'll, I'll put them on the hot seat you know <laughs> so let's start let's start. okay guys um should i even welcome you guys but okay okay <laughs> let's just start okay so i welcome you guys to my channel my okay. billions and first of all, I want to say thank you for supporting my channel, you know. That is what we, you know, brothers have to do. We need to support each other. And these guys have been brethren since day one, you know, and we are gradually growing. So I want to say thank you for um, supporting me. And yes, we've also done a video on um, the, what video did we do? Like, uh, well, uh, I can't remember the time. Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> what, what is the video? I thought it was about uh, the... <laughs> Questions the Russian, yeah, yeah, weird, weird questions, questions. yes, weird that Russians yeah. ask. You see, we've been shooting like yeah. we are, we have more than 100 <laughs> videos on this particular channel, so yeah, weird questions Russians um, ask foreigners. So I'll leave it in the um, description below, you can check it out. And yeah, so guys, um, kindly introduce yourself from Mega to yeah, what's your name, your no, school? You've your already introduced me. Come on, okay. So, what's right. the name? My name is Mega. Yeah, I study in uh, Gukin Russian State University mm -hmm. of Oil and Gas. Mm -hmm. No, third year. Okay, I'm trying to be gentle, like official, like formal. So, yeah, yeah so yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, my name is Kennedy. Uh, I also study in uh, Gukin Russian State University of Oil and Gas. Yeah, I'm also in third year. Okay, okay. Now, guys, so these are my. Um, I, I, I will interview them right away. You know, we want to, you know, bisect, dissect, trisect for 
you have for sex? <laughs> everything is sexy. So exactly. Everything yeah. Sexy. yeah, exactly. So, yeah, today we are going to talk about oil and gas. I know you guys are studying oil and gas, you know, but I don't know much about this stuff. So, um, you guys study oil and gas, right? Or, yeah. or petroleum? Like, what yeah, is yes, what petroleum is the... engineering? Like, that was a broader area. Yeah. Petroleum engineering. Ah, uh, so petroleum engineering is the program itself. That is yeah. the course. Yeah, uh, it is wide. That was the overall in the general. So the um, 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 petroleum is just a subject and uh, no no oil and gas comes under petroleum. Okay. Yeah. So what, which, then which which area do you specialize? In? Like, yeah, we are doing uh, drilling of uh, oil and gas fields. Yeah. yeah. No, there are other uh, no uh, parts of the uh, the petroleum engineering course. We mm -hmm. have. Uh, a place for those doing with the the tubes, the tuba pravoda, those things. Those uh, who are doing only gas. Uh, uh, yeah, so it, it's a it's a, a very broad um, uh, course, mm -hmm, and then mm -hmm. yeah, we are especially in, in drilling. Oil and okay, gas, yeah. okay, okay. So okay, okay. So it's like. Um, Maybe computing, you have those who are specializing in networking, those who are in um, artificial intelligence, yeah, you know, right. machine learning. Oh, exactly. okay. 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 So, um, what, what? why did you guys choose this this field? Like, there are so many, you know, fields. So, yeah. Mega, no. Mega has to answer this question. <laughs> because the way, the way, the way, the way you like, yeah, nah. yeah, you need to answer this question. Yeah. No. Yeah. No, this is for Ken to answer. Why? <laughs> no, no, no. Ken, you want to answer this question? <laughs> like, why did you choose this? Because we know that Russia, you know, when you talk about Russia, it's, it's either medicine, all right? Mm, yeah. yeah. So why petroleum? Like, why petroleum? Uh, like, let me see. Me, for instance, mm -hmm. I don't want a place where, like, I will rigid. I want to be in a flexible field. Okay. Yeah. So with medicine, like, you're going to start in one place. But with this engineering, at least you can, even though it's an industry, but you still like got to be flexible. You have places you can move to. Mm -hmm. Like with this, maybe for now, I'm specializing in drilling. But maybe if I'm done, maybe I can't take a different direction. Mm. Maybe I can go into management, anything. But it can still be within the same industry. Then, lucky enough, oil and gas engineering then my program we do a lot of like things that concerns uh, IT oh yeah machine learning really 3d modeling oh art okay artificial intelligence okay yeah. oh that's true right yeah Oh wow! So like oh. this is is somehow. No, broad. you know, I thought you ju you guys uh, just specialize in the drilling aspect. Like for instance, you go to the field and then you use the machine. Like mm -hmm. you are yeah. doing galaxy. <laughs> no. You know, galaxy. This is advanced level yeah. of galaxy. The, the, <laughs> drilling, the drilling itself is a uh, it's a whole process. You know, yeah. it, it has a lot of uh, like you have to go through a lot of things, a lot of calculations. Like a lot of um, like modeling, as you said. Mm -hmm. So it's not so just you, you just with the conceptual machine. models before yes. the main thing. You have to develop your. Like, um, there will come a time where you have to develop your own like software. Oh, we can okay. help you like when you are drilling. Ah, okay. Okay, yes. that is why. Then you... it has a, lot, a whole lot of calculations, as he said. So you still have to like develop a software that can help you with the calculations. Oh, okay, okay. I think why do you have to develop the software if the IT guys are there? Like, if you develop well, the software, then what will I do? Because you know I'm into you know uh, computing. So mm -hmm. if I am, I'm a computer scientist or computer engineer. I am responsible for developing such you know, applications for you guys. But what you guys will do is that you just guide me, you know, you know, give me the guidelines yeah. as to what you want to do. You know, it's not as we are now coming to be the the <laughs> IT you know, specialist to develop the software. But you know, we we are going to work on the field, uh -huh. and then uh, like it's a it's a teamwork, okay. you know. Okay. So um, those guys in the IT the, the IT department. Mm -hmm. They develop the, uh, the the application, the softwares, and those things. But we have to we take what they they've developed, mm -hmm. 
we help them develop what yeah. we want to use on the field because yeah. we are going there we know what we are going to do yeah yeah so it's like we are combining our ideas with yeah. theirs and then we produce something that can help us to no, maximize our production on the oh, field. Oh, cool, yeah. cool, cool. So and you can also make changes. Maybe the software comes, but you want it in a different way. So yeah. you can make changes. Yeah. Like at least you should be familiar with like yeah. the software you use, the knowledge about the software, the the, the things you'll be using on the ground. And again, um, yeah. This okay. Um, so, excuse me, sorry. So it means that when you need, for instance, you need a a, a software application for a particular project. Mm -hmm. The, the, the software, the IT department develops the application by your help because you know you are on the field, so you can say, okay, we need it like this and that and that. Yeah. And once the application is ready and you you apply it in the field, mm -hmm. when you when you when there's time for make uh, for you to make any changes, you are not a person who makes who have to make the changes. Oh no, <laughs> but the, the developer has to make the yeah, changes, right? Do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you don't, guys, tell me so. Tell me something, what, what is so interesting about your film? What is so unique, you know? No, um, this particular uh, film, uh, no, the, uh, this be, oil Wait, film. wait, let me put yeah. you on the hot seat. <laughs> <laughs> are you doing this because of, uh, you know, our resources in Ghana? Because you guys want to just go to, you know, go back home and tap into our oil and then be chopping our money. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, no, no. yeah. 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 we we having a uh, like yeah the feels yeah now now yeah, we are we are now uh, exploring the oil in in Ghana right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I would say that is one of the reasons why we came here. Ah, so it's because, because of the money. <laughs> not because of the money, but you know, this is a new uh, field that is coming, mm -hmm. and then. They need the, the you people. Just have to help the your personnel. You, 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 you know what I'm saying? Just help That's why we are here, you know? <laughs> <laughs> like, so, yeah. so, see, I, 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 uh, you know, I've, I've caught you guys. No, 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 no. Because the, 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 main, the main inspiration behind your studies is the money. Because not, you, not, not, the the money, money. not the money. It's like, not like everyone are, is standing for the money. Yeah? <laughs> you are also here for the money. Of course. Hey, you go to school uh, to work for the money. Uh, like, he's studying for the money. Uh, like, he wants the money. Yeah. Uh -huh. but, like it's just for the motherland. Like uh, no, it's not. It's not that I am studying for the money. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I am studying a field that I'm going to work in. Okay. When you work, you get paid. Okay. Yeah. So what? So, what so, is it about so, the money? So it's the not money. about the money. <laughs> no, everything. Okay. Is, no, the inspiration is not the money, but yeah. it is. Um, uh -huh. we coming here to work as uh, like to study uh -huh. and go back. Help our country our develop country. our resources. And then you get it. It's yeah, the passion. Okay. The passion that counts. Oh, not the money. Yeah. Yeah. Like really? the passion. The passion. The way you oh, are yeah. saying it is like the passion. No, no, it's the because passion. Like, it's just the passion. Yeah, actually, yeah. actually, I was mm -hmm. talking right now. Um, like the people, the the personnel that are needed in the field of oil and gas. I don't think we have um, many many in, in in Ghana. Okay. So I think that's that's one of the reasons why the government chose to you know send some of us out mm -hmm. to go and learn, mm -hmm. come back and help um, okay. develop the, that part of the world. Okay. Okay. Now let let's talk about your your program like the petroleum engineering. What what are some of the subjects you guys you know study and you know petroleum. Um, you know, engineering. What what are some of the subjects? Okay, from from the beginning, like from the first year, they we do the just... yeah the, the basic ones like the physics, the um, chemistry. Uh, we did math. So, um, what is your medium of study? English or in Russian? We study in Russian. Ruski. <laughs> are you serious? Are you just kidding or what? Like. Now you see the camera, so you don't flex like, for real. No, 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 no. Why do you do that? No, no, for real, for real, for real. Like, in Russian medium. What? Yeah. <laughs> 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 so you break my decision. Huh? I just salute you. Okay. Hey, Russian medium. Yeah, of course. My but goodness. I just me. I took a transfer from my. I, I was also studying in Russian, and I realized that, bro. I'm not going to continue, so <laughs> I just took transfer because, you know, okay, you, okay, just tell me. Are you guys able to really understand what goes on in class? Like, because I, studying in Russian is something, like, I have experienced this, so, are you able to understand? Like, <laughs> well, right from the beginning, after the, part like, the, uh -huh. the, the language course. Uh -huh. <laughs> And then we entered the first year. First year, like first semester. Transition, you know. 
then you make confused. <laughs> like you go, you, you go to the like you go to lectures. Mm -hmm. The professor is talking, and then you, you don't. You, you are seeing you, stars. No, you are you are okay. just there. Okay, no, no, no. <laughs> okay, let, let let me let me put some. Uh, you know, is it like when we in uh, the preparatory department? Yeah. we had this uh, time like this course. Like it was a uh, linger phone. You mm -hmm. go to that like uh, computer room. Yeah. Then like you you put on earphones like you put it on then like they play a speech for you yeah. then you do the typing okay but i wasn't taking it serious but he was taking it serious no, oh serious. okay no he was that doesn't, like, doesn't make any difference no, no. So like, they, like, they, they, they were, they were, you know the, the language you know it's very easy to to write yeah. very easy to read if you know the alphabet you can read yeah. and you can write but memorizing understanding, and understanding what you are doing no, is yeah. not, like, that's, that's, that's yeah. the main yeah. thing no, you know? but still two days maybe mostly won't go for lectures me like I asked him like hey, Kale, which, which word like, like you, you are not serious <laughs> no nah <laughs> I'm not serious like, <laughs> okay so like after what after the transition like as, yeah. after you were enrolled in the field and yeah. you, you were supposed to like catch up yeah with your studies it was quite challenging it was quite challenging but mm. like and for me it was really bad I mean I would say it's bad for me uh, look I bad. have I have a serious history you know I also uh, when I came you know. I was supposed to study software engineering in Russian medium and unfortunately for me I had a problem with my face uh, you know, I think after the seventh month so I had to go back home and when I went home and came back I, I forgot everything like previous yeah. uh, I know <laughs> so when I when I came oh, back yeah. I need to just you know start you know that was in September so yeah. I needed to you know start, start like, my own program software engineering trust me the whole semester I was like I was seeing stars like yeah. I felt so stupid in the classroom like nothing <laughs> and you know the thing is that the professors you know they understood my situation and most of them were trying to do you know help me with you know studies some yeah. will send me uh, um, materials in English some will try to send me in words so that I can translate they were just helping me but I realized I'm better it will be something I can I cannot yeah. continue you oh. know I so, also have this history. So I'm quite well. surprised you guys, you know, are in this field. But you know, so during, you know, uh, in the course of study, do your your colleagues, you know, your Russian natives, you know, the colleagues, do they help you, you know, to really, you know, understand the course, or do they help you make some clarifications in English, or try to help you, you know, during studies? Uh, in English, you know, you will not get connection, but. <coughs> You know, I make friends with uh, the like, foreigners. No, they are not Russian. We are in different groups. From, we are in different yeah, groups. Yeah, we are in, oh, he's, okay. in a, he's in a different. Oh, group. I thought you were in the same class. Oh, no. no, like oh, it's one. No, the same it's one faculty, okay. one department, okay. but we have two groups. Okay. So okay. he's in like I'm in one group. He's in the other. Group, oh, okay. So we are not in the same. Oh, okay. In my in my in my group, I have group some have like many foreigners. Like his group of foreigners, there are many. By yours, natives. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Not that he has also, he also has some there. Yeah. Not that like, they are all foreign. They are not like, They are all Russian. They are not also me. No. Okay. But like, first year we were only two. First mm, year. First year okay. we were only okay. we. Like, myself and one Arab guy from Egypt, who were the only mm. foreigners in the class. So, like, the Russian natives don't really help you or do no, they help you? We had a close friend. Like, yeah. Yeah, like, I, I make a couple of friends. Mm -hmm. and, like, they were helpful. Okay. Yeah. Now, in terms yeah, of in my yeah. in my 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 class, the Russians, you know, sometimes I ask them questions. Yeah. yeah they, if they they want to help, they will help. But if they don't want to, yeah, they they, they, they won't. Oh, but okay. but the ones that help me to maybe if I have a problem with my assignment, yeah. they are also foreigners. They are from those uh, like the Tan Tan Uzbekistan, Tan Tan Uzbekistan. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. They are they are my good friends. They okay. are in my class. Okay. Oh, now the, the the next question is what. Does your faculty or the school, you know, do to support uh, foreign students? You know, knowing that you know yeah, the language is actually a barrier for you. You know, do they do they, do they have they put in place a mechanism to help you, you know, smoothing your education? You know, here like do they help you in one way or the other? Uh, well, the no in my school is all foreigners are just like Russians. Yeah. We we are we are a student. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. You don't really So they don't have any special treatment. No, there's nothing special. Like, maybe have... personally with the professor, maybe one or two, mm -hmm. they know we have difficulties with the program. So yeah. maybe sometimes when they are about to give some tasks, yeah. 
they can give you some, you know, something to make it easier for you to do. But they think school, it's easier. They, yeah, they, yeah, they, they think it's okay, easier. Yeah. But like you still get <laughs> yeah. it. Like. Uh, <laughs> but if you say the school, the school, no, you are just a student, and then everything is like you are, you are performing like a Russian student, a native, because yeah. they, they think you yeah. understand yeah. the language like, perfectly. Uh, then it comes with like funny you know, the foreigners who are out, like our population in the school, we are like less about two percent, mm. like made up of foreigners. Then that two percent, then comes the Tajikistans and like, mm. they, and they are majority of the foreigners. Oh, okay. So we like those who like in general had no idea like with the Russian language yeah. before coming like. We are not. We are not that mean. Like we are. They don't. They don't really, really care about. It, so he just like. No, he just, he just hustle and tussle like. Mm. He just moving. Like, mm. <laughs> no, okay. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. So now let's let's talk about um, the education like exams. You know, yeah. uh, in terms of exam, how is the exams conducted? You know, it is in Russian. Uh huh. We have like writing and oral. Yeah. yeah. Then some like writing. Like when you write, like you've done nothing yet. Just have to go and speak and uh, defend whatever you want. Are you sure? Are you sure? Because you know, um, the, you are just uh, just two percent of the whole you. No, no, they, they don't dash you, but they just award you mad. It's difficult. Just great. They, they just mm. consider you your struggles. Is, they they will say, okay. No, before this black get, man has been no. hustling for a very long time. Yeah, yeah, before, 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 before you must hustle, you must sweat. Yeah, you, they must you hustle. You know? No, you sweat because like before, uh, like even the last semester, the, the, uh, yeah. our previous semester. You know, yeah, <laughs> there was this this, this uh, program that we were doing. Uh, this uh, like engineering graph. Yet, uh, 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 yeah, 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 like this thing, uh, breaking off, like, so or, like w or this thing. It's drilling. like with rocks, drilling, yeah. like yeah, those like machines, drilling and, those the and then yeah. like the kind of rocks. Yeah. Then how to like break rocks? You know? Yeah, yeah. And it was on the uh, online. Distance, online. Mm -hmm. So like the 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 the, the, the lecturer. He was like, yeah. In my class, in my class. Yeah. He told. At the end, when he was about to give the the shot, you know, yeah. because we have to go to him. Yeah. He will ask you questions, like general question about the, the the whole thing, and then you you explain how you understood it. Yeah. But you know, some people get automatic. You know, yeah. I, I know yeah. automatic. automatic. Yeah. Like, yeah. You pass without going through the 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 And, the, and that, yeah, that those counts the marks you get from the test. From the test yeah. and those things. Yeah. No, yeah, we we, we 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 did well. And then yeah, when he came, he came first. He started from the, his My group, class, you know. and then he gave him uh, like after you know after math. So he will not go to uh, uh, to go and answer any questions like to him again. Like uh -huh. you when know. other students yeah. or the other students are going, like that's a mm. excellent. Because score. he said he, he said that we are we are trying as foreigners. Yeah. So he understood that even as foreigners we are, you know, your effort is he's okay. seeing it. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. So when, when you when you put in a little effort, some some will see it and then may consider yeah you are the end. Okay. Yeah. This was what was happening like to that lecturer per se. Yeah. Even when we're in school, mm -hmm. you go to the board. Mm -hmm. He calls you like either you you answer or you go to the board and answer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So even when it moved and then it was online, like he's, he 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 throws questions in class. Then sometimes like he clicks, then he answers, even though when the question is not directed to him. Mm -hmm. Like you click, then like you you stand up and answer. Mm -hmm. Like or sometimes he takes the question to you. Then if you can't answer, you tell him, Oh, I can't answer. Mm -hmm. So he he was taking notice. Mm -hmm. So your class participation and everything. Your class yeah, participation everything. then okay. that's like to the level like you can even like they will put a consideration and see that you've really kept like some work. Yeah. You know, if you come to even like exams or to do like defense, that yeah. you're like at least he, you've proven yeah. that you've yeah. learned. Yeah. 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 yeah, you've proven yeah. that you've learned, and that's when like that thing comes. Yeah. So, in terms of answering questions, sometimes it's very difficult to express your express. Express. You know, that, that express. Yeah. That's, 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 that's you, get the, you have the idea yeah. Yeah. how to even. Put it like this a language where your vocabs are limited. Yeah, yeah. Like I got the, you. the expression becomes so difficult. That's uh, where my problem is with uh, this language. Because <laughs> yeah. you know you can't express yourself exactly. <laughs> because uh, when you have uh, exams like uh, maybe a physics, yeah. physics exams, that you have the idea in English, you can write something that can describe the whole a, a whole phenomenon. Yeah. yeah. But 
yeah, like in this language, you no, know, you don't know the words, uh -huh. how, to how to put the words together. So it's it's so, a problem. So in, yeah, so in this case, if you have the option to choose uh, a Russian medium of study and English medium of study, which one? I'll go for English. Can I put that a second thought? I'll run in English. <laughs> They are understanding. Yeah. You can easily get it in class. Yeah. But yeah. like once they do no. it in class, you uh -huh. get it. Yeah. But here, yeah. like you have an extra workload. Like yeah. let me say, an extra one. Because mm. you go to a class, you get it. Even though you have to take it, over come over. over, then you, you go in and take it like even mm -hmm. how to understand it and get the concept. Okay. Then after that you have you've gotten it, even if you go to English, then you get it. Yeah. Like how to bring it to back to Russian again. Mm -hmm. And even if you take it like because Charlie, because every day we meet a whole lot of new ways. Yeah. Every yeah. day we, yeah. we meet yeah. yeah. There's some of them we, we don't even know them. Mm -hmm. So you can't like you force yourself. They can't be translating word by word. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So um so from from our conversation, I think um, education in Russian medium is actually stressful. It's very tedious yeah. and involving. Even though yeah. you might be able to communicate like on the street, yeah, you because know. you learn yeah. Russian language. That's different from what yeah, is inside the class. What is inside the incubator <laughs> itself? No, yeah. The Russian you speak it's, on like outside and the world like it's, it's, so it's then, different. You go like you go to like uh -huh. exams or like with a teacher like to defend the course. Then you sometimes you just become like a dummy. Uh -huh. like, like you learned nothing. No, it's not like you've learned nothing. Uh -huh. You've actually learned. You you've had the understanding. Yeah. But now yeah. how to put it sometimes you just be like, how to express that expression. That's it. Yeah. Uh -huh. The then expression counts. Come. How effective is your studies, you know, your program? How I think you should. Okay, <laughs> okay, mega. Uh, talk. You should answer this question. How effective is your program? Well, I mean, I see it. Like, in terms of how it is coordinated, you know, the study process and yeah. how the professors handle the yeah. educational stuff. No, like, uh, like frankly speaking, now uh, it's it's been effective because mm -hmm. we have aside lectures. Yeah. You have tutorials. Yeah. Then to that we then like then uh, technical courses. You have uh, practicals as well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you see, like one course. So then the, the then exams. It, you have three times like. You okay. go for it, lectures, yeah. tutorials, and lab. Okay. And lab works as well. Like you do, you do the experiments. Like you get the chance to do. We are not many. Okay. Then you, we are divided in subgroups when you get to the lab. So you get like you fill the thing. Oh, oh, cool, yeah. cool, cool, cool. And uh, in terms of the relationship between the students and the you know the professors and the lecturers, how is it? Is it? Is it? Um, mm, yeah, it's it. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I think it's it's, it's normal. Yeah. You don't you don't have any special no, relationship. No, nothing special. Maybe yeah. everything yeah, is formal, special. like formal yeah, stuff. Yeah. So yeah. you don't even, you don't have you know some kind of rapport. You know, sometimes you meet you know your professor. Oh, and you can vibe. With <laughs> oh, no, like, I, I think that one is for the uh, maybe those 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 Russian guys who. Wow. Yeah, because for, for, for me, like my university, I can I can meet my professor somewhere, you know, like after class, I can just hey, you know, I speak with him, we just vibe. And, if, you know. if, if you have a question, ah, for so him, yeah, you can ask. But strictly educational. You want to go and uh, what he's passing by. And then yeah. say, uh, <laughs> Let's go and you know, drink beer. No, 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 like, uh, maybe like maybe maybe <laughs> some maybe sometimes like some can yes you maybe they want yes add something with you, but some self, like they don't really know you. Okay. Yeah, we know, like, mm -hmm. we really like. Mm -hmm. No, so when you you've studied, I believe you all studied in Africa. You are studying now in respective yeah. countries. So uh, in terms of comparison, the educational system in Russia and in general, you know, you know, uh, in Africa in general, like, you know, is, is there a very big difference, like, that we have to even, you know, uh, kill ourselves to be here, like, yeah, something yeah. so unique, you know? Uh, yes. I've, there's a difference. Uh -huh. I've not been to the university in Ghana okay. to know how it is there, but first, I don't think there's a, a big difference like that. Mm. No, no. Mega? Mm. No. Like, uh, you too. <laughs> there should be. <laughs> Even though, like, yeah. okay, uh, let's uh, see if you just like to do the same okay. program in Ghana, yeah. in English, yeah. then uh, doing it here in Russia, which one would you prefer? Um, okay. Which one would you prefer? What? Like doing the same program, program like in, in Ghana, yeah. in English, yeah. then doing it here in Russia. I'll choose Russia because why? Mm -hmm. 
when I come to Russia, mm -hmm. this is a new, a whole new environment. You know? yeah. There's some kind of exposure and all those yeah. things. Like like when, when, yeah, experience and those things. And we know that maybe, yeah, yeah, Russia, they have uh, this, um, they are one of the biggest oil producing countries. Okay. And they have this uh, experience in the oil industry. Uh -huh. when, you, when you come here, you, you know that, yeah, they can, Know, the practical aspect of the study of the course, mm -hmm. you, you get much of it. Yeah. But if you say like they, um, what they teach, yeah. like the, the 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 subjects and all those things, I think we have the same things in Ghana. Yeah. 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 Just that I think in in our minds, we yeah, think, we think that it, it's, so it's, it's too are. much here. Than yeah, the, but yeah. I, I I don't think there's there's much of a difference there. Mm -hmm. apart from the exposition to. Like the exposure you get yeah. here, yeah. there's not too much. Uh, you want it's, it's not anything. Nah. Ah, your IT, yeah. your IT. Now, are you are you not interviewing no. me? <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. I just want like you okay. yourself. Oh, feel free. I I had my you know bachelor degree in Ghana. Yeah, so, so that one like, like per se like the IT like yeah. in Ghana they here. Was there any difference? Uh for me I would say there's 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 difference. You know, uh, because personally. The rate at which I was studying in Ghana yeah. is different from here. Yeah, you were. Uh, no, no, not really. You know, not really. It's just that, uh, you know, in Ghana our class size is big. Yeah. And you know, the ed education, in the exams itself is tough. Yeah. You you understand? <coughs> but here our class size is, is we were just twelve or thirteen, yeah. and we have this cool relationship with the professor. So even if you are not able to understand something he goes yeah. extra mile to help yeah, you to nice. understand so it really gave me the opportunity to persist you know always talking to the professor even i remember there, there's a couple of programs that was very difficult for me but because of the relationship i developed with him he was able to you know you know uh, help me out you understand and yeah. at the long run i was able to just yeah, like that was the interaction yeah, yeah. then it like it's, it's a difference yeah like, the there interaction. Is, there no is, you uh, say uh, yeah. no in in relation to like the student uh, professor the professors yeah. you know, because in ghana yeah. as you said like the, the, the class, the, the class is big yeah. and then you don't have that uh, kind of relation with the with the professor uh, you but know, here yeah you you, you you say no there's an advantage yeah. of all these things yeah. but you, like the 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 <coughs> Like the content of it's, the thing that yeah, you, there's not much difference. The subjects are um, they are the same. Yeah, like but you know the the subject it itself stands alone. Yeah, you understand. Yeah. The main work is the inter, the interpersonal relationships. Yeah, so, that with, with the people and then with the professors. You understand. Mm -hmm. you no, know, one thing I don't know if this is good for the camera, but you know, you know our, the professors, most professors in. in in Africa, you can't even approach them like that. How you can approach your professor here? Yeah, you understand? Mm -hmm. Because there is this, you know, psychologically we think they are too. And that helps a lot. And it puts fear. You know, they are sub I have I graduated yeah. with colleagues who cannot even talk to their professor. You understand? Yeah. But here, the professors, they are like, they are like our brothers. You know, yeah. they are they are like you our sisters. Like ah, you, they come class they put their lab we, we just vibe and then we start lessons you understand so for me in my field you know i will not speak for other people but in my field i think you know the interpersonal relationship is a key to educational success because yeah. when you feel very comfortable with your professor you yeah. can learn more from them, you know yeah then and, like, and could you believe that when i was doing my thesis i could even write my professor at 2 a.m and he replies you know that you can get that same relationship with a professor in, in the university. Like yeah, the university of, course, of course, but it's it's you know like it's quite difficult. No, to, like to here, get. like they've built that structure. Yeah, that structure, the has structure been is built. Free, it comes yeah. like automatically. Yes, because when you start like there's like maybe aside your timetable, yeah. the usual classes, there's the professor has a time for consultation. Yeah, that you can go again. Yeah. Clarify whatever you want to clarify. Yeah. Like these things have like they've been like structured. Yeah. And like they help. Like uh, yeah, they really help. No, I'm not saying that they don't all these things that they put and that gives a difference. Yeah. No, there there is an advantage of all these things, but when you're talking about um okay, okay, you can say that. But yeah, but for the educational me, the, the, like the what is inside is, there, is, what is inside there, the 
for you to grab. Yeah. It's if, almost the same. It's if the same. these things were to be there also, yeah. you, you won't see any of it. These are some of the things that, that make like this place a big uh, um, advantage over ours. Yeah. Because, because, because they have all these things structured in place. No, they, mm -hmm. I think the fact is that we are developing and they are, should I say, develop. Okay, then you then, understand. Yeah. So it makes, you know, education here at least you know, yeah. highly considered yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll because we that. are developing, but they have the system no. already structured. And there's one more thing, yeah. like here, like let, let's take uh, petroleum engineering for instance. Yeah. You know, like it has like, it's broad. Yeah. So for we over here, once you start, you start like from bachelor's first year, you start specializing in one field. Mm -hmm. you know? Because like we, you can decide like maybe Maybe if you want like the development of the oil and gas fields, you can go to that side. Or if you want uh, the transportation, mm -hmm. that's a pipeline uh, engineering, you can do that. Then if you come to a development, you have a uh, drilling of oil and gas wells, mm -hmm. and you have those some people to choose to do uh, like ex exploitation and uh, production. That's like uh, oil gas. Yeah. Some do production of oil oil. Then we have like the the gas condenser as well. Like, okay. So this one you start okay. with bachelors, but you start specializing from bachelors. But when it's like Ghana, we do like in general, like general. Are you sure we don't have just this? They don't specialize. I have mates who are doing petroleum engineering in tech and in uh, UMAT. Mm -hmm. They just do it like in general. Petroleum so they, engineering. They, 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 they study it's everything. Petroleum engineering. They, they do. Okay. Specialization comes when they do like when they are doing masters. masters. Yeah, then that one they even have to consider doing it in Nigeria. Yeah, because for for we we per se like we just started producing oil not quite long ago. And you know this like this petroleum engineering is still coming up. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So there's still a okay. lot to do okay. Okay. over there. Okay. So there is still a lot to do. Actually, um, we've we've had a cool conversation. You know, yeah. this this has been a lengthy conversation. We've we've we, you know wh when I you know then times when you go to ch church you said deeper side it means you should you should you should <laughs> dive deeper you know and this this video has been very you know engaging you know because we've tackled all angles and we've spoke a lot about this whole petroleum engineering thing from courses to the challenges you know and everything so if you are um, someone who want to further education in Russia you can make a judgment yourself or you want to study abroad you can make a judgment yourself here they have um, the facilities at their disposal, you know. Uh, do do we have petroleum in English medium here? Um, I think some schools. Okay. But there are few. Okay. Like I don't really know much. But okay. Like they if they even have like few mm -hmm. which will do it in English. Okay. Okay. So um, I think uh, we've, we've spent a but lot of time. Up, yeah. Going up like to masters. I think like masters. Like yeah, masters. Ma yeah, ah, bachelor yeah. degree is mostly done yeah, in, in the English. English. In, in, in Russian, Russian yeah. but masters, masters like, yeah, yeah, like yeah, 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 that is that is true, that is true. So yeah, so let's wrap up. But you know, before we we just bring our conversation to an end, let's share some cool experience in Russia. You know, how is the weather? How you know I did you know the racism thing? Like just just two minutes or five minutes or something like we are just having a cool conversation. So how is the weather? You know how. Uh, what is the challenges? You know? Frankly speaking, I've not met a racist before. Oh, really? Yeah. So, what, what are you experiencing in, in Russia? You know, um, have you had any bad experience with the natives? You know, have you had have you had um, a crazy argument <laughs> with? <laughs> you know, you know. <laughs> Bro, tell us, come on, everybody's looking at you, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, like, well, like, to be honest, like, the girls, I've not, I've not, I've, hey? I've not met a racist before, like, to be honest, I've not met a racist, yeah, yeah. like, that's true. okay, you've not met a racist, no, okay, okay. no, 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 almost I'm three not. years now, yeah, okay, no, I don't know, a racist, and what, what about the weather, you know, the weather. <laughs> no, we see it. No. It comes now. Now you are kind of used to it, right? Uh huh. Well, first winter was like <laughs> it was hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. So, um, what about girls? You see, these people they have this misconception <laughs> that 
Russian girls are, you know, like, they're just there. So, Russian, they want to come here, you are black men, so you get a lot of girls, one on your head, one on your toes, you know, be crying. You know, be crying. So, what is we told them? Let them go. See, uh, on this channel, no, like, who me. said it? Like, oh, come on, it's out there. Everybody, uh, that is a perception, you know. Yeah, it's the same, the, the, you know, no, the you, same you as are people think. A whole continent, like a whole black society. <laughs> yeah, but you know, the, people think that when Russians are racist, but like yeah. Russian, like that, that is first misconception. Mm. You know, they think, That's you true. know, Russia is not a safe place for them to be. You understand? So now we are telling them that it's false. Oh, yeah. And about the ladies as well, people think that Russian girls are just there, you know, they're like, yeah, excuse me to use this word cheap, and then because you are black, you yeah. know, they'll, 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 they'll rush they'll you. Rush they'll rush you. you. No, no, you can't get it. Uh, you no, you, you can't match for 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> and I think it's, it's for those who want. You know? Yeah. If you want, you will get. Yeah. That is so yeah. that is it. If you want, you will yeah. get. If you want, yeah. you will get. Yeah, so, um, okay, so I think. Um, we will bring our conversation to an end and once again I'll say a very big thank you to uh, Mega and Ken for spending more than 30 minutes it's an hour. my goodness it's been an hour. <laughs> Jesus Christ we spent a lot of time bro <laughs> yeah so uh, thank you for your support always you know but do not forget to check uh, our other video that is the weird things Russians subscribe uh, yeah the the, the the weird questions Russians ask for us yeah. and uh, please if you do enjoy this video kindly hit the subscription button um, and also like this video and share to your friends or families and um, God will bless you for you know helping your brother you know so God bless you and thank you bye bye peace out mm. Thank mm -hmm. you.